If there was ever a way to capture a northern Michigan vacation and a Caribbean vacation under one roof, the landing on Lake Charlevoix did it. Northern Michigan's beloved Caribbean getaway opens back up Memorial Weekend, bigger and brighter than ever before. Our attitudes and everything is just bright and sunny all the time, and we reflected that in the, the color of the building inside and out. Lake Charlevoix boaters have been eagerly awaiting the landing's renovations. And let's just say they've created a beautiful blend of staying true to the old, yet bringing in the new. It's well worth the wait. The Key West vacation vibe and subtle Caribbean notes, complete with Jimmy Buffett music playing in the background, makes any local or vacationer feel transported to island time. The windows open up inviting dockside diners to take in Lake Charlevoix while sitting on colorful stools, sipping Hemingway cocktails and imported rum. And of course, munching on fresh food. We took all the things that we loved about the old building and we tried to really um, uh, integrate them into the new space so it would still feel super familiar to everybody and um, uh, wouldn't be too intimidating to our, our regulars that have been coming here for you know generations. While the dockside dining destination served over 1,200 meals a day in the old building, the owners are excited to see what's possible next with a larger kitchen and exclusive wood-burning grill. We got a, a really beautiful grill, um, a wood-burning grill from a company called Grill Works uh, that uh, they're built in Atwood, uh, Michigan, which is just right down the road from us here. We we're lucky enough to have them build one for us uh, right here in, in northern Michigan, one of only two in, in Michigan at this uh, point in time. And that grill isn't the only piece of the landing that's local. From the architecture to the construction, artwork to student staff, the landing features all local talent. Full of character, full of charm, you'll want to check it out for yourself. Doors reopen May 26th. Heck yeah.